Hi guys, David Texas again, and what I've got in front of me is my little ES339. And I thought I'd give you a shot of this thing before I do any more modifications on it. I'm going to put a new bridge on it, a new nut. I'm going with the roller bridge. And all that means is no drilling or, or messing with the guitar. It means taking the, the uh, tuner crappic bridge off of it and simply just placing on the roller from uh, Stumac. And I thought to give you an idea, I need a sound base for this or sound bank, so I'm going to do it in stereo, right? And that feedback you're hearing right now, I think you can hear it, is coming from my Line 6. Um, there's grounding issues because I have this thing st uh, plugged into uh, two different uh, oh, uh, electric uh, lines uh, via my different amp lines. So there, there is an issue there, but uh, it's not going to electrocute me, it's not going to cause any problems, it's just going to be a little hum for a while. Anyhow, um, I want you to hear this thing, it sounds beautiful in stereo. Amazing, I've got both the pickups on, I've got the uh, humbuckers and the nano magnet on. And of course I want to adjust the nano, I'll go back to the back and uh, turn up the gain or turn up the bass or treble. Let's see, let's turn up the gain on it. Adjust the treble and bass, see what we can come up with, guys. Wow, that E is unbelievable. Listen to that bass. <laughs> wow <laughs> I dig that <laughs> nice thing is everybody's out of the house everybody's out of the office just me so I can play it loud as long as I keep the windows shut Okay, now, <clears throat> let's switch it. Let's go to just the nano mag, and you hear the uh, uh, work it's doing. And that's coming only through my line six with the nano mag, the acoustic sound. baseline on this thing is amazing. <laughs> Alright, the nano mag can only be adjusted from the back of this thing. I've already done some adjusting to that. Um, not bad guys, not bad. Alright, now only on the uh, uh, on the uh, humbuckers. Good to stay on this thing. Anyway, let's put it down on the treble. A lot of growl on that, a lot of treble. Listen to this. expect 
expected. It's going to have that nice fat bluesy sound to it. guys that's it um, next video is going to be on a comparison to the uh, uh, what you call it comparing the 339 to the um, what you call it to the uh, uh, my 355 which is the same as a 335 or 345 it's just the different uh, things that are on it making different guitars and I hope you check that out as well as the modification on the Chinese guitar I just put a new one up and I'm working on the next one number four so that should be along here sometime today or tomorrow. And five and six are on the way too. Just takes a while to get these things done because they're about two and a half hours long. I gotta pair them down to about an hour. So don't bore the shit out of you guys. <laughs> Put you to sleep. Just watch today's video and go to sleep. <laughs> anyway, that's it. So any questions about this or anything else, give me a holler. Dave in Texas. Bye.